Is your poodle giving you some attitude? Uh, do you wish your Maine Coon would swoon? <laughs> well, then uh, you have come to the right place. Hi, I'm Brian Pounders, the region's leading pet interpreter and PhD in domesticated animal translation, which is a real thing that you do not need to look up. As a nationally recognized pet whisperer, uh, I can help you and your pets have the meaningful conversation that you, you know, both desire. So let's take a look and a listen to, uh, to what our furry friends are saying right now. He just found out he only has four lives left. Mom, I didn't kiss you goodbye. I should never have eaten Thai food. Do you guys see bees? I see bees. That cat is allergic to cats. That cat is a hamster. No judgment, but that cat has a foot fetish. Dude, I can taste colors. I want to whisper sweet nothings. Sweet nothings. This is what I think of stale water. Oh, I shouldn't have had ham for breakfast. So salty. I love it when the water runs over me. Or maybe they're just thirsty. Thirsty? Yeah, that kitty is thirsty. Super thirsty. In fact, they're usually thirsty. You nailed it again, Pounders. Nothing ticks off Mr. Tickles quite like an empty water dish. And with July being Pet Hydration Month, it is up to you to keep their water fresh, to keep their water clean, and keep their water flowing. Because a hydrated pet is a happy pet. Or so I've been told. By the, by the pets, because I can communicate. Which reminds me, uh, I need you to excuse me, uh, because I have a three o'clock with the Honorable Judge Mittens. If you'd like a little more information, you can check out these, uh, these GIFs down here, or GIFs if you're super pretentious, whatever you want, a GIF or a GIF. Hey, I'm not one to judge, or gudge. Gudge, judge, I don't. Just check them out. Uh, they got more details on uh, do's and don'ts and uh, statistics and brain things. <laughs>